Hello all, I'm Jakub Schlenk uh, and I will present you a video abstract for heuristic modeling of macromolecules release from PLGA microsphere. Uh, short introduction to the study. I would like to ask a few questions. First, what was the aim of the study? And then how it was achieved? Uh, the aim of the study, uh, we have obtained predictive, uh, we would like to obtain predictive model of in vitro protein release uh, profile from PLGA microspheres. How it was achieved? We've implemented uh, heuristic, uh, heuristic modeling uh, tools like uh, multilayer perceptron, monotonic multilayer perceptron, or uh, genetic programming. Uh, tools which we've used uh, were first of all uh, literature survey was done um, according to the, the results uh, in uh, databases like scopus.com uh, protein structures were <coughs> were obtained from uh, databases like PDB or uniprot.org. Uh, uh, then those structures were uh, imported into uh, Marvin of Camaxon. Uh, this is one of that structures. And then the chemical descriptors were calculated using C CX calc of uh, Camaxon. Uh, and here we have those this uh, plugin web page. Uh, then we've implemented modeling tools uh, like NETS 2013 and this is uh, the software uh, all written yeah, it works and of course uh, our environment packages uh, Packages like mm, like FS Carrot, RGP, OptimX, and Mon MLP. Mm, summarizing, we've obtained database from a literature survey. Uh, and we put uh, chemical descriptors calculated by uh, Cam Axon Mar of uh, Marvin and CX Calc. Then we've implemented heuristic modeling, uh, and in final stage we've obtained uh, two models. Uh, classical model equation and um, uh, artificial neural um, network model um, and those model uh, were predicting uh, release uh, of protein uh, from the PLGA uh, microspheres. So we encourage you to visit the uh, web page of uh, International Journal of Nanomedicine and you can easily download the, uh, our publication and of course if you have any question you can always email uh, me or uh, corresponding author Alexander Mendik. Thank you for your attention.